information from Ace Public Adjusters at our website. You know where it is, cbsphilly.com. Just click on Talk Philly. Well, coming up next this noon, how to keep your dog calm during a thunderstorm. Also, summertime is ice cream time. Don't drop your ice cream. Next, we'll sample a flavor you probably haven't had yet. Beer ice cream. We'll be back. I'm a big believer. You know, on a hot summer day, nothing is better than a creamy ice cream. Of course, some guys would much rather have a frosty beer. Now, just in time for National Ice Cream Month, you can have both in one treat. My man, Matt Kruger, manager of the Victory Brew Pub restaurant, is here with an ice cream like no other. Matt, good to see you, buddy. Good to see you, too. Thanks my for man, having me. My man, give us a little background first on the organization, because uh, you guys are in Downingtown, right? We are. We're located in... Uh, about 100,000 100, square feet of manufacturing facility. We've been in uh, a refurbished Pepperidge Farm bakery for 15 years. Wow. And we make uh, over 30 different styles of beer in a year. And we've got a 350 seat restaurant that is connected to the brewery. Beautiful. And we make uh, some pretty cool stuff there as well. What are we going to make here? What do we have on the table? We're talking ice cream and brews. Break it down to us. Where do you want to start? First of all, what do we have? What do we have over here? All right. Well, right here we've got uh, two different kinds of grain that's been uh, toasted a little bit longer, a little bit less, mm -hmm. and this barley malt is going to be the building block to make beer. After you cook this grain, you crush it up and you cook it with hot water, you get a liquid called wort. Mm -hmm. This wort is very sweet, and we take that wort to make ice cream before we add hops to it and then ferment it to make alcohol. So this product right here is very, very sweet, does not have any hops in it, and does not have any alcohol in it. Okay, okay, very good. Now, what do we have right here? That type, I want to get into that ice cream, but tell me about it first. Okay, I will. This is called Hopped Up Devil, and this ice Hopped cream- Hopped Up Devil. This There's ice a rap cream. group named Hopped Up, I'm just playing, I'm just playing. Go ahead. So this ice cream is made with the wort that would normally go into making this bottle of beer. I take the wort, I reduce it down to make a syrup out of it, I then mix it with cinnamon, cayenne, mm. and I add in chocolate-covered espresso beans. That's what we have right there. That's what we have right All there. Right. So why don't you give that a whirl? Tell okay. me what you think. I'd love to. I'd love to. Hopped up. Yeah. Mm. Whoa, that is very good. That is very good. A little different. Ooh, it's got a little bite to it, too. That's the cayenne wow. and the finish. Cayenne. All right, let's move on, my man. All right, That's sounds delicious. great. That's mm. delicious. Sounds great. The next beer that we have right here is our Golden Monkey, which is a Belgian triple. Okay. And we take the wort from this beer as well before it gets hops, before it turns into alcohol, and we add... Before it turns into alcohol. It's non-alcoholic. Okay. There this we go. I want to get that out there. inspired ice cream. Okay. So we've got banana ice cream, oh. and we mix in it caramel salted toffee coated peanuts. Oh, no, you don't. Check it out. Oh. <laughs> All right. Well, I, mean, I think I should have something to wash the palate, as they say, but no, I'm good. Mm. Not bad, huh? <laughs> Whoa! Excellent, excellent. Okay, we have to finish the third one. I'm going to hold this one for you. You might have to. That actually is one of our most popular ones well, out I, of the I three. I can see why. I can taste but, why. Uh, it's, not, it's not my favorite out of the three. It's my, not. my favorite is the next one here, so we'll get into this one. <clears throat> the beer that we use for our last ice cream we're going to talk about, which is Storm King Crunch, is a Storm King Stout. It's an imperial stout, very big beer. What we do is we take that wort from the Storm King, we mix it with chocolate, then we throw in chocolate-covered malt balls, mm -hmm. and you're uh, you're up to bat on your last one. I'm up one. to bat, man. I had a single. I had a double time for a home run. Forget the triple. Here we go. You guys are very. This is a very popular organization. Right? A lot of people come out. Uh, yeah, a lot of people do come out. We see thousands of people every week. My man, Matt, you have done it. You have done it. Congrats to you and everybody. It's a family-run business. It's a family-run business. Bill and Ron are the owners, and. Uh, they take good care of me and let me do wacky stuff like make uh, ice cream with beer in it. You can get wacky with us anytime. I, well, I appreciate you, it. Appreciate it. Continue success. For more information, check out cbsphilly.com and click on Talk Philly. We're going to take a short break. We'll be right back. You have to try this. Let me tell you something.